And we got bananas in chat from Surprise T, Monkey Ben, Billman68, Red Skimmer, Camo J123, Nacho Love, Lord TD, Catkin63, Toma, Sheepstra, uh, Kona4Kai, Derp222, 8701, I Love Cats, Winnie T Ford, Mick, Mixin New, the one and only, uh, Inivev5, Sweeney Dunstan, Sw Syntax Air 37, Inivev5 again, Binky Quack, and that is all the bananas in chat. And Binky Quack is here, resubscribe for 15 months in a row. Thank you so much for 15 months of support, I appreciate that, buddy. We are jumping back into swag and sorcery, and oh my goodness me, it looks like we are starting this one off with a little bit of a sub bomb. Jeez! Treelander. Or Trelanda84, thank you ever so much for your generosity here. Gifting subs and supporting the community. So if you hear your name being read out loud, you're now a subscriber. Uh, Mary J. Carney. Uh, Martha Cabean2. Martha Cabean2. Mole Gamer. Moose Bale King. And Wicked Jester94. Feel free to throw some emotes in chat. Maybe. Maybe some love hearts for. Treelander84 saying, Treelander84 in chat saying, let's get off good. Well, that is a good start to the stream. Uh, we are playing Swag and Sorcery. And peeps, I won't be able to stream tomorrow, and most likely I won't be streaming Tuesday either. Um, so, yeah, so I wanted to do a second stream today just because I have the evening free. Been out all day though. Been to a pub, had some lovely food. Had a great time. Um, yeah, just had an awesome day, really. Right, and if we get ourselves back into what we were doing here... Oh yeah, uh, I streamed earlier in the day, if I didn't make that clear. We did Hermitcraft this morning. That'll be published on the second channel right after this, uh, this, this stream goes live, right? Sorry, this stream ends. Words. Well, it's been a long day. I've been, I've just kind of realised I've been in the sun all day, and now I'm feeling the effects of it. Seaward123 is subscribed with Amazon Prime. Seaward, thank you so much for subscribing with Amazon Prime. I appreciate that. Hope you enjoy the stream. We kind of unlock this second area, right? Free! I'm going to guess this one's harder than that one, right? So we're going to go there and start grinding out some runs. Obviously. We need more heroes. Upgrade the guild. Upgrade buildings. So we can upgrade this building. And I guess we're going to have to get the wood to do that. And then we'll end up upgrading most of the other ones. It also wants us to do this. To create a library. Okay. Bring the blacksmith ten ancient plates. That's probably a new thing. And so that is as well. So we just got to start doing the runs. I don't think there is much else to be said about it. And uh, off go our duo. So we just got iron ore. That's new. We'll probably have access to a new type of... Of... Uh, like weapon and swords and all that. Right, and we are taking you out straight away. X, will you revisit Sky Factory Forces, Dutch Farmer? Now I'm really done with that that pack. I didn't enjoy it. I tried my very best. I had visions of what I wanted to do with the modded in my mind, but I couldn't make it come to be, and I just got fed up with it. I, I might play a mod pack again at some point, but as of right now, I'm waiting for 1.14, and I think it would be. Uh, why it's just to wait around for that. Alright, let's fight this rat. We have to kill five of these, right? Rat tail and healing leaves. Cool, and that gives us 4% towards fighting the boss. Now, we've figured out a fair few of the resources there. So, copper ingots, we can't make iron yet. I guess we have to upgrade first, right? That's probably how it goes down around here. Let's make sure the morales are high. And we'll get back in there again. What kind of game is this, says 40 Buster? It's um it's a little bit of a clicker game, but not quite. It's like a hero's game. A uh, little element of RPG. But generally it's a grind game, you know, you just keep doing this gameplay loop over and over again and progressing. Oh no, no stream in two days, says Bella Nuts. Yeah, next two days probably not going to have a stream, so... Yeah, we'll, we'll wait and see, but who knows. Static Cat says this looks like a fun game. It's been a fun game to stream. This is definitely not a game I would play without streaming. This game is on iPad for me, 
two blizzards, says DK. I could see this being a good game to play on the pad, pick it up every now and then and have a jam. I got locked out of my iPad today. I was so annoyed. I was going to use it uh, while I had a bath. I was going to watch some Netflix and I got locked out on my iPad. I've never had it happen before. And it says the person whose request, like, you know, the account has, like, done this find my device thing and locked me out of it. But I'm the owner of it, like... And I haven't logged into any iPad, I this, I that, anything, and it's claiming that I have requested to have my iPad blocked. Ugh, it's silly. It's silly business. Okay, uh, so we need to do the planks. Why do we make those planks? Wolf leather chestnut plank. Hmm. So we need to upgrade the guild. Wait, did I just... No, there. There it is. But it wants a pipe hunting lodge. Okay. Hunting lodge. Is that the hunting lodge? That is the hunting lodge. That's a chestnut plank. Am I going bonkers here? Oh, look. This one requires pine logs. Ah, I see. So we upgrade that. Ah. So why does it have a dependency? Because it needs dark leather. Hmm. Sad plank. But anyway, pine plank is what we need a bungee of. So we'll uh, we'll send you over there. Now this thing requires. Yes. Okay. So we're on the right path now. That's good. I also want to send you over here. Make sure we've got lots of healing potions. Now, we can also start to make some of these things soon, maybe? You know, I'm seeing that they need, like, one thing from, yeah, the battlefield and dark runes. It might be those are the two areas and we're supposed to do them in tandem. That could be a thing. Hmm. Right, so anyway, maximum crafts. And it's going to take 30 seconds to do that. That's fine. Asuma, what show you're watching, says Humble Letterma. I wanted to watch the... I think it's the last episode of the new Star Trek. It's It's been alright, that show. It's had its moments, but it's not been over the top. It's certainly no next generation. I might not even tune in the next season, I don't know. It's It's been alright, that's about all I can say. Hey, we can do that now, that's terrific. And that helps us progress, and there's a competition. Hmm. We've had no... I, I'm going to ignore that. We've had very little success in that direction. What do I get? Five of those, excellent. Well, I've got a job for you then. Which is to get back over here and make more pine planks. Now have we unlocked... Yes, look at this. Bandit stuff. So we need to start making dark leather and get to the next level. I'm assuming all of this is better. It looks like it. How much dark leather can I make? Well, I might as well do that while I'm here. Knowledge is power. Uh, so we've got to build a library. I could do that now, actually. That works out nice, didn't it? Asuma, you seen what we do in the shadows? It's a good... I think you watched the movie, right? Says Humble Lita. Have I seen what we do in the shadows? I'm not sure if I have seen that. So, what is this? Is this going to be like mana points and stuff now? What is a library? I don't remember... This looks like spells. I don't remember seeing this in here, but it was ages since I looked at it. Uh, I'm looking for spells or the library, and I'm not seeing it. Field treatment? Hmm. I don't know then. We'll have to figure that one out ourselves. Anyway, we've got this, so we can do that, and it'll tell us what we've got to do next. Let's skip the story. 
Jess says, Asuma is playing Swag and Sorcery, an RPG where you build your own fantasy village, train and equip your heroes, and send them out to collect swag. That sounds like it, doesn't it? Uh, Bread Force says, Good morning. Good morning and good evening to you. I Loop Cat says, The new Star Trek isn't the best, nothing compared to the good old Discovery. That's right, yeah. It isn't trying to be the next generation, though, which I think is a good thing, right? If it tried to recreate it, that would always be, you know, it is what it is. You always got to try and make new things. So, that is actually... Was that the first thing in the library? We might as well do it then, yeah? To progress. Here's another thing, by the way. While we're, while we're chatting and waffling and doing all these things in the village, we could have these out adventuring. And I hope that they don't encounter something that kills them, because I'm, I'm all the way out here doing this. This bunch of nonsense, that's what I'm doing. And I don't think I'm going to enter the competition. Asuma, how do you deal with post-series sadness, or is that not something that happens to you? Ah, that is actually something that has happened to me. If you've heard me t talk and waffle about stuff uh, in the past, um, I often talk about this idea of stepping back from your emotional experience and looking at it from a different angle. Like, don't don't be the thought, look at the thought, something like that. And I've experienced post-series sadness, and I've experienced, like, nostalgia sadness when you're watching, like, Metallica in Seattle 1989 on the An Justice for All tour, and it's like, oh, oh, I wish I was there. I wish it was now. Like, it's so easy to do that to many things, and uh, it's you've got to realise that, hey, thinking like this and having this kind of, like, oh, it's over now feeling, and it being... i tell you what, though, the first concert I ever went to almost cried after it. It was such an amazing experience and I was like, oh, that's it. And then then not long after my first concert, I went to Download Festival, but I had a different reaction after that. I, I didn't I, I felt the sadness like of like, oh this thing is over. It was such an amazing experience. And then I was like, I'm gonna do this more. <laughs> like I I didn't feel sad at that point. I was like, I'm gonna do this again and it's gonna be awesome. So my, my thing with like post-series sadness is just look forward to the next show, like keep looking forward to the next thing and what it, not just TV shows, anything in life, like l look forward all the time and keep enjoying and moving forward and don't get caught up in that kind of sadness because enjoy the thing while it's here and then it's going to be more awesome stuff happening, like we do awesome stuff all the time, right? Uh, okay, energy collecting. What is this? Craft 50 points of mana, reward... This is starting to get complex now, peeps. I gotta craft mana points. Probably means I've gotta make this thing. Magic store. The secret of the cube, what is that? Okay, so we're just collecting things from our runs and then we've gotta come back here. Also, how much money do we have? Because at some point we wanna hire a new character. Uh, looks like we've got a low health situation here. But you still got potions, haven't you? I need to equip you with more of those. Um, because you are gonna run horribly low. Hey look, we've got a massive stockpile of these, that's good. That is good. They also have a... oh, that's just a filter for that. Okay, what's next down here? Heavy... heavy wand? We haven't... heavy hand, was that even? I haven't even seen where we use this. I've got a feeling it's in this area. Uh, we just got a victory, that's terrific. So I need to keep making pine planks. And can I make iron over here? No, we want to upgrade this pretty quick, actually. I could whiz on through doing all this stuff, but... Well, maybe we need to. We'll see. We'll see what happens. Asuma, have you ever tried Huel? It's a metal supplement, a meal supplement powder, not a meal replacement. I've been on it for a while. I enjoy it. No, I haven't. I've, ne I've never had the need to supplement my meals. And you say... You say not meal replacement. Supplements shouldn't be used as meal replacement either. Supplements are for when you can't provide yourself with it for other means, right? Like, I don't eat a lot of meat, so I have protein supplements with my meat. I mean, they, 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 they don't, they're not as great on their own because they can't provide all the uh, essential anemo acids that are used for creating um, muscle, you know, protein synthesis and all this so like taking a powder to replace a meal or supplement a meal like that's only for 
having no access to the meal, right? Because it, it, it's not a meal, it's just... It's going to end up being a bunch of calor calories, right? What am I doing here? I'm getting a little bit unfocused. Can I... Have I got enough for this? No, so we need to go in for another run. Okay, this time when we're going for a run, I want to click on this spells book. So we didn't unlock spells. No, wait, it does say here at the library. So whatever that first one was, I can't use it. Maybe because I don't have mana points. Maybe because I need a character with a... Hey, that guy's elite and he's kicking my butt. Stop kicking my butt, guy. Ah, the potion isn't good enough to heal all the way yet. It's getting close here. Wow, that got a lot of gold. Weak essence. Ancient plate, we need those. What is this game about, says Morocco Slav. Just about having fun together. Chilling out, slowly progressing through the game's gameplay loop. Oh, we might be in trouble now. Ah, you're dead. Oh, this guy's... I'm going to retreat. Oh, we get to keep hardly any of that. Hardly any of that. Fair enough. So, oh, I kind of need to send them out again, don't I? Let's uh, let's get you all relaxed and maxed, and ain't too taxed. I like that motto of look forward to soon, Mrs. Alpha Shard. It's a good motto, it really is. It's healthy. Because if you're going to look backwards, the past is the past, you know? Can't go back there, can't change it. Humbly alter me, says my name is actually a reference to my personality, because I'm an ultima supremacist, and I'm quite humble about it. We are literally the best and only giant robots can stop us. I mean, I'm not really into supremacy myself. And now you're saying you feel discriminated against. What? <laughs> what is going on? Surprise T says, people ask for Soylent and stuff like that because making a meal is just a huge waste of time, says Surprise Sober. It's not a huge waste of time. Having a proper good meal is... It feels great to eat a nice properly cooked tasty meal doesn't it it's part of being human making sure you eat regularly and get good food and it's good nutritious food supplements can't be as good as nu and nutritious as uh, as properly cooked food right humbly uh, humble says I'm a it's a joke I'm a nerd okay well I don't get the reference Craft some mana, says Beard for. Well, you know, it's guiding me that way, but I really want to get the wood so I can make the planks and upgrade so we can use the iron and make better weapons at the moment. It's hard to say. It might actually be a really good idea to not do that and get the mana going. Binky Quack says, I'm more with X that it's good to supplement an existing proper diet. Yeah, supp you, you just got to keep whatever it is you're eating, consuming... If it's a supplement, it is a supplement. You supplement it. When you can't get this for whatever reason, a supplement is the second best thing you can have, right? So, if you've had a really long busy day, no time to cook, maybe you're getting on a train home, there's nothing in the shops, but there's like one of those protein supplement candy bars, which I quite like. Grab one. Like, you know, it's, it's not as good as having a proper chunk of meat, is it? But you'll get your protein that way. Well, you'll get some of it. <laughs> uh, Oz Ozaratis says, Making a proper meal is the best about the meal. Yeah, like, ma making a meal, like, it's the best version of a meal you can have. Anything else is going to be less, isn't it? Right, um, so now we're going to, are we going to make this? We still need more of that wood. Did we pick any up, even? I wasn't paying attention. No, didn't even get any. I'm also tempted to go into this other area, but I think we're going to try and get our wood first. I'm sorry, but it's true Bethesda is like going on full microtransaction and making game unfinished. i I got no idea what you guys are talking to each other about now. What's a sad plank? Says the bird boy person. It's a plank with tears. Are you out of potions? He might be out of potions. No. He drank so many last time. I want to collect all of these things. I've got to retreat. That sucks. We've got next to nothing. I totally forgot that you're going to need more potions. Ugh. 
I'm, I'm doing a bit suck here, aren't I? Anyway, we've got that. <laughs> that helps. Gold, go on then. 400, cheers. Thank you very much. We need goals! Now we've got to kill 10 goals. We've got to kill all the things. Uh, I'm tempted to go in that just to get rid of it off this list. Go on then. Go on then. We'll go. Go on, let's show off our swag. Let the contest begin. I haven't seen any like other cool, funky looking stuff like these lot have got. One! Oh, this is a waste of time. My friends, this was a complete waste of time. We are still getting copper, apparently, so I might as well craft that up. Which means I still can, in a way, do stuff like this. Might as well make a sword, I think. Down here, then, are we still getting... We are still getting that stuff come through. What about the old wolf levers? But wait a minute, does, is that that's not the same stuff as the old dark lever, is it? We'll do all the crafting. And we don't have those, so we've got to go figure out where to get those from. I'm going to try a run in the next place along, I think. Okay, so we did the thing, what happened? How did I do? Probably so bad they won't even tell me, that sounds about right. Okay. Oh, there it is. Results. Yes. Yes. So bad they wouldn't even tell me. So now if we go into our equipment shop... Uh, damage 11. Rubbish. Rubbish. Should we hire a new character? So many decisions to be made. Let's hire a new character. I don't think that money's going to go anywhere else right now. Rosaline! And what can you do? I think Rosaline's going to be our mana character, right? I shouldn't have sold that sword. We could have given it to Rosaline. Hmm. Uh, what's that? The marketplace, yeah. So what can I make with these levers? Just the old bandit stuff, right? Wait a minute. Isn't the bandit the new stuff? And what is the hunter's helmet? That looks like a special one. Now, I was going to go craft the other stuff, but here's the thing, I can pass it on. So, we'll go to Noel and check out this new gear that we got. So the bandit's helmet is better than that by... Well, kind of almost not, because defense goes up, but damage goes down. Bandit's pants... 6% more damage than the scout's pants. Great. I guess it's worthwhile, sort of. And the bandit's jacket. Less damage, bit more defense. Increases damage from critical hits by 2 to 1%. That's kind of brutal. But still, I'm not entirely sure about that equipment. Um, also, are you able to... Yeah, look, out of the uh, level. Required level 2, at least. Jeez, I forgot about all this. Okay, now you can at least have some armor. Okay, that makes you a little bit better. Um. Right, I wanted to go check out this area. Is it tougher, or is it just two that we do parallel, right? Now, at the same time, what I might be able to do... Let's come over here and just fight the first one with the Birdman, where we started before. Oh, this doesn't look good for you. Oh, this doesn't look good. Okay. How do we get through that the first time? Hmm. Wait, they're the wrong way around. That's really bad. That's so bad and stupid and, oh, what a fall. That's all my fault. <laughs> oh, I'm not very good at this game, really, basically. Isorex says, well, as long as the Sumer is playing it, at least it's fun to watch. Oh, I'm glad you're having fun watching it, buddy. Let's go relax our heroes and then let's buy the next spell as well. That's another thing we need to keep doing. Um... Let's get these back in here. 
So what else can you make? Nothing. Oh, you can't do anything. Alright, that's fine. Down here. Okay, can you make anything of use here? Let's make the bandit's helmet. Okay, now I think what I can then do is upgrade this. And hopefully this will give us access to... Yeah, iron ingot, right? And we can make a lot of that, seven. Which means that we can possibly make a new weapon, soldier's sword. But it requires some pine planks. So we won't do that yet. Then we can make these three things. Four, two, and two. Alright, then down here, was there anything else you can make? Oh look, new weapons as well. I think that was all you could do. Okay, so back to the equipment screen. There's a lot of this, grinding out, looking at these things. I'm not sure if it's that great, really. Wow, that's good, but that's for our other, our other fella, right? Oh, I had to do emergency mute there. I don't know if you heard that or not, but I had to sneeze violently. And that is what I had to do. Okay, so let's sell the bandit stuff. Hey, look, it makes a lot of coin, doesn't it? Interesting. I guess you could expect that, really. So then Hoshi, hopefully, will be better off with this. More damage, less defense. I'm going to go with that one. Required level for that is free, and required level two over here. So, way more damage for less defense. Hmm, I'm going to go with that. I'm going to go with that trade-off. Because you need stuff to wear, right? Okay, so one more level up over here. And you are hopefully getting strong enough to fight on your own eventually. I think you need a weapon first. Okay, so... Let's send them out. Uh, to this area, yes. And nine minutes ago, when I was completely engulfed in all the decision making of this game, uh, Torindo resubscribed for four months. Torindo, thank you so much for resubscribing. I appreciate your support. And I hope you're still there. Because, uh, geez, nine minutes. Totally distracted, aren't I? I Iro Seb says, actually, you need to give Rosaline. Need to give Rosaline what? Don't end the sentence like that. <laughs> Azurisir says, cooking for an entire week at once, but it tastes best out of the pan. Um, if you cook every meal, fresh out... Wait, who is that? And why were they being held captive? And what does that floating thing there mean? What was all that about? That was interesting. I've not seen something like that happen before. Right, I have no idea how much materials we got from that. I should probably just send them back in for another round at this point. In fact, I think I might train up a stat over here. Increase strength, perhaps, for those extra hearts on Hoshi. Ah, uh, you've had it before, but... I'm going to do that, I think. And maybe again, because you're a tank. Okay, and then over here it's uh, agility each time that we want to train up. Just going to make them a little bit better with some of that extra coin we got. Right, let's go back in. Uh, it was this one that we went to this time. Competition available. Hmm. See, now that we've got different gear on, we might do a little bit better, but who knows. Uh, Humble Ultimus says, have you ever played Crypt to the Necrodancer? I have, and I think I might have live streamed it as well but found it way more difficult to play when live streaming. But I played that game for a bit, that was a really cool concept. Is that an idle game, says Kate Kaka. It, yeah, it's not quite. Idle game, clicker game, it's very much built on the idea of having a core cool gameplay loop, but you do do a bit more than just click. But it, it feels very... the progression feels very slow and sort of stagnate -y. Doesn't feel like you're jumping through hoops all the time, so to speak. Okay, let's grab our heroes. 
craft up that, I guess. There's not much we can do with that. So what can we do over here? Do that, I guess. Yeah, we're not really picking up a crazy amount of stuff. Scarecrow's shirt. We're starting to see some more interesting things pop up in here now, aren't we? Bandit's crossbow. But really what we've got to prioritise is that one over there, I think. So back in they go for another round in this area. And let's see if you're ready to go that way. Why has that got three faces on it? Got some armour now, haven't you? Oh, straight away an elite monster. That weapon is awful. Double strike was that. Yeah, Rosaline really needs a weapon because we're just wasting those healing potions. Right, now hopefully you'll get a little bit better now. How are you going to do against this one? Oh dear. Okay, we're doing good up the top. Lots of gold coins. Maybe Rosaline needs some more upgrade first. Okay, let's send you to these places. And then over here, iron. What's the other thing we might have here that we need? Right, did Rosaline win? Get in there. Probably out of health potions now. Nope, one left. Come on, you got this then. Oh dear. Right, there could be... Yeah, I don't think Rosaline's good enough for this yet. Do you have more health? No, you don't. We're pulling you out. We're pulling you out. Hmm. Not spending my money wise enough. How many more planks do we need here? Five. Let's get them all in the spa. Let's go through again. Hey, Asuma, do you like platforming games such as Sonic the Hedgehog series or Mario Brothers series, says Kuroki Fan. I really like the classics. As a genre, um, I probably wouldn't pick up a new platforming game. Shovel Knight interested me quite a lot, but I never got the time to properly play it. Um, but some of the classics like Rayman, Crash Bandicoot, uh, Sonic and... Not so much Sonic, actually. I, I like the look of Sonic, but the game itself never did too much for me. But the classic Mario ones are great. My favourite one was always the third Mario game. The one with the world map. That was so awesome. All these different levels. Right, how are we doing on uh, on healing potions? Yeah, we've still got some. We're good. We're good. And I think those stat upgrades we made are helping us here. We seem to just be causing a ruckus against these baddies at the moment. We should probably look at crafting some more armor soon. There's a lot we should do, we just... it's slow. So I'm constantly thinking about, what can we do? Because I don't get to do stuff that quickly, is the problem, I reckon. Um, let's send them back in. Then let's come out here. Okay, you can craft stuff for us. Hello, that's interesting. Right, we need all of those. Eight. Right, and these things I've seen needed to make other things. Ah! And it looks like there's a few things here we can make. What's that? A mana pot? You can't help your character with spells if you have no mana. Ah! I think that's what we need to get going on that front. I could make one of those. 1k? No, 15 out of 1k. And 2 out of 23. Right. Okay, the game's starting to open up a little bit. So, let's go look at some of this gear, right? Like, Sorrow Stones and Stinging Skin, or two of those and two Stinging Skin. Where do we make the Stinging Skin? We make it here, but we don't have the Rotten Slice. So, two Rotten Slice and two Grey Sting. But I can't make two of those yet. I think we'll wait until we get some more stuff. Right, we're going back into the other one. This one's a bit different. Let's make sure they're maxed out on their health potions for the next round. Uh, 
Assume, are you a fan of Dark Ostro? I don't know what Dark Ostro is. So I'm guessing probably not. The Mana Pots is a quest to make. Oh yeah, it is, isn't it? 50 of them. I thought we had to make this thing over here next. Huh. Well then, I mean, we could start making them, but we might as well wait until we have 50 in reserve. Ooh, what's going on over here? An elite monster. Yikes, that thing is doing some damage. And you got wrecked. Look, there's some... Is that the mana pot thing? I think that's the mana pot thing. Okay, down you go. Cool, that was awesome. Um, let's get the morale up before we do too much more. And this time we're definitely going to need this. Also, what about that stuff? Elegant plate. What is this even used for? Desecrated iron. We don't know yet. Now, did we make the soldier's sword? It's kind of a bit tricky to keep up with everything that's going on. You have the militia sword, so let's get the soldier's sword going for you. And then over here, dark leather, pine planks, make all these things, and we'll leave it at that. Although the weapon might be a good idea. What are these stats telling us? So this one's a bit more, def oh, it absorbs magic damage, increases agility. That makes so much more sense for our character. Let's actually do that. Let's get the crossbow in here. Right. So over here, Hoshi should have a better sword, yep. More damage, more defense, that's brilliant. But, the strength would give us better crafting ability when wearing that. Which makes me wonder if I should hold on to it. Man, this game is crazy, right? Uh, let's have a look over here. More damage, only 5 to agility. Again, we craft better when we've got the other one equipped. So if we want to sell stuff, it might make sense to swap those weapons around. Do we really have to grind it out, like with that amount of detail? Why can't I use that? Required stat STM14. Stamina, I think. Looks like we've got 25. Hmm. Oh right, wrong character. So I'd have to do that twice, yeah, I'm not going to mess around with that. Right, I think we should... Hmm. Let's train Hoshi up a level. Okay, and then let's go back into that area. Ah, uh, we got a noise in the ear from the one and only. It's Leah Leia. Resubscribing for 35 months. Saying, holy smokes, 35. I hope you've had a good Sunday, Asuma. This game looks rather cute and chill. What's it all about? Uh, Leah, thank you so much for 35 months of support. I've had a great Sunday. It's been wonderful. Look, there's a uh, captured fella again. We're saving their souls, aren't we? Um, this game is basically, yeah, it, it kind of is an idle clicker game, but it's also got elements of RPG and it feels less idly and clicker. Like, although although you're not constantly doing a click and getting a reward, it's it's kind of like a constant gameplay loop, and it's kind of slow as well. The progression in this game is. It's a very slow paced game. Look at that ghoul in the background haunting that fella. <laughs> awesome, right. Are we any closer to getting some more mana pots? Elegant plate, this is one of the things that we were looking at using a moment ago. Somewhere in here we make use of that. Was it the weapon? Oh, forgotten where it was. Hmm. Huh. Totally forgot where I saw that. Let's send them back on another run. That's all we've got to do. Just runs, runs, runs. Do the mana pots give mana points as Unbound Shadow? I believe so. We just got to keep grinding them out. We're at 41 now, so we're getting there. 
We've seen sorrow stones, the things as well. And we need two two of those rotten slices, if I remember correctly. We haven't got enough for that yet. That's where we saw it, but we got no use for it yet. That's why I'm getting all kerfuffled and confused. Well, it looks like they're doing their thing over here. Whoa! Oh, we ain't got a pot! No! Oh, no. Can you hold out? It's going to be a close one. We've got a load of good stuff here. Nice! <laughs> right, one more to go. Ye, we might get this. Depends on pots. Let's check out our pots. Yeah, you got a few left. So down here, we need as many of those as you can give us. I think we need to go back to the first area to get all of them. Yay, so we got all that stuff. That's really good. Okay, we'll drop you back off in your areas. Now here is where... Let's check it out. If we click here, right, increases 30%. So if I go to my equipment and swap over this sword that adds more to my agility... Yeah, see? 33%. So it makes more sense to craft this stuff with that on. We can't make any stinging skins yet, because we can't make the right slice. So we're still not ready for that stuff. But we can use some of my materials to make some coin anyway. Um, pine planks? Just one. Mm. Hmm. Hmm, maybe we didn't pick up a lot of stuff then. Over here, though, we definitely picked up some mana pots. Oh! Oh, it needs two each time. Wait, why can I only make five, then, if I've got 50? Am I missing something? Maybe you can only make five at a time. What do I not have enough of now? Maybe they maybe they only store in stacks of five. Or maybe I'm only supposed to make three of them and it's like one per fifty? What points? Mana points crafted. Oh my god, I don't know. Everything was confusing then. Cheers. Thanks for those rewards. I don't know what they mean. It burns! Cast the spell of fire five times. Easy. Easy, we'll do that. We will do that. So I now have the mana points up here. Got it, right. Put you in the right positions. Let's heal you up at the spa. Let's go on a run. We'll go to this area. So what happens now? I click there. No, that didn't do anything. Aha! Take that! So that costs 25 of my 25. We got a noise in the ear! It's Zachariah here, resubscribing for 12 months! That's a goldy face in chat right there, saying, Hey X, thanks for being so chill. You're welcome. <laughs> uh, thank you so much for the uh, resubscription. I appreciate the 12 months of support. Hope you are enjoying the stream. Doesn't this guy, like, not have any healing potions, I've just remembered? Good time to remember that, isn't it? Well, we'll try and keep you alive with our spells. How about that? Get wrecked. Okay, that's all my mana points gone. And clearly we didn't need that. But I've got to do that five times, right? So I've done it twice, which means I'll need more mana points. When do I get the new mana points? Victory! Wonderful. Because you crafted three at once. So is it a thing in my inventory that I have? Hmm... Well, here's the thing we've got to do. We've got to get those healing leaves, strangely enough, which means probably going to have to go back to this area. Let's do some runs back here. So what happened to the rest of it? 
If I craft one now, it lets me craft one. Now I've got ten points. And now you let... Wait, wrong thing. Is it going to only let me do four? Ah, I get it, I get it. So you can only ever craft to fill up the amount of mana you have in total. Right. Now it kind of makes sense. Now it kind of makes sense. How are we doing over here? We're wrecking everything in sight? No healing leaves. Mana tube is five, pot is ten. I just got a bucket. Don't know how many times it gives you that. Yeah, J Wizard, you got all the answers. I wasn't reading, was I? Dark is a guy that develops the mob packs and a few of his packs of Sky Factory 4, Sev Tech. Ages and Invasion. Ah, okay. Someone in the modded community. Um... I don't want to do this just because we're no good at it. So it's still that one that's the problem. There's nothing else. Aha, now we've got something new. So ectoplasm and desecrated ingots. Desecrated ingots require elegant plates. So let's go make an elegant plate. Let's go change the equipment of Hoshi to the one that gives us more strength. Okay, now we're going to drag you over here to make two of those. And then you'll be able to make the woodcutter's helmet. Nice! Let's see what this is then. Ensures that you're well protected from enemy attacks. It's got some random stat over here. Oh, it's, a ran it's literally a random effect. Well, that's cool. Stop desecrating ingots! Like an evil overlord, says I Leave Cats. Maybe it's maybe it's Evil X doing the stream, you just don't know. Okay. So if I put that on, ice damage resistance and 11 strength. I'm actually going to go with that. I think that trade-off is good. It will also make crafting stuff a lot better now. Yeah, look at that. We've gone up to 21%. Now, do I have... I can make some of these, and that means that I could make something around here, possibly. Wait, you want iron? I'm clicking on the wrong thing. Ten. Let's make... I don't know if we should hold on to them. Let's just make a couple of things. Greaves and a helmet. I don't think I'm wearing either of those, right? Soldier's helmet, yeah. Hmm, so I could pass that soldier's helmet onto a different character. There's so much juggling of Okay, I'm gonna I'm gonna say this. I'm gonna say this clearly right now. This game is slow and you constantly have to juggle and micromanage little stats, it feels like, and that is not massively fun because it's so grindy. Yeah, I think I'm gonna put that on you. Maybe you want this. No, it doesn't really make too much of a difference. Okay, so now I've got to go back and check that you got the right sword equipped. This is so grindy. Come down here, I'm going to sell that. I'm going to sell the greaves and the helmet we just made. And I'm going to keep the... both of those, yeah. So that... having that extra stat for crafting doesn't really return much in terms of uh, money, so... that's something to consider. Right, we need healing leaves, and we get them from this area as well. Let's try this one. Look at that! Look at that wooden helmet. That's going to win a competition right there. We got a noise in the ear. It's Lizzie Bess here, resubscribing for 26 months. Lizzie Bess, thank you ever so much for 26 months of support. I appreciate it. Thank you ever so much for the support. Zachariah says, first time he hasn't butchered my name. I thought I've said it like that before. Darkstro is known by his. Logo of a penguin holding a disposable cup of coffee. Ah, oh, okay. Cat says, I like juggling. Well, good for you. Uh, Lizzie Vess says, Isuma, what are you doing streaming so late on a Sunday? Just uh, got a little bit of extra time on my hands. I just remembered something as well. We need to wreck house here. Get wrecked. Just like that. Okay, let's go over here and make five of those again. 
Let's take them to the spa, make sure they're all relaxed. Max, they ain't too taxed. Do we have any of the... We've got planks to make. Those ones. Bam. Right, with that, we should be able to do this at last. No, it costs five. Of course it does. Of course it does. Right, we're going to do this this time. I've decided. Okay, we've got swag now. Oh, I can't send in a third person. Anyway, I'm just going to do that. Let the contest begin. Maybe this fella could do a run on his own. Probably not, but... Who knows? Uh, oh, Hunter's Pants are now available. As well as the Scarecrow shirt. Chance to heal the whole party. That's pretty good. That's really powerful. Yeah, we just need those things we can't get yet. We can make one. So we need more of that, really. Infected flesh. In the dark runes. How are we doing over here? Lizzie says, I had a fantastic concert last night, so I'm quite happy. Cool, what was it? Who was playing? Uh, Karuko fan says, So, Sumo, what's the story behind your Minecraft skin? It's Doom. That's what it is. Hey, look, we got some leaves. Hmm. Okay. We need those leaves to make these. Ten potions. Good, good, good. I have to kind of wait for those potions to be made, though, in order to equip them before we go in. Hey, look, we had enough of that. Let's build it. What what goes on over here? Cotton fabric. Oh. Interesting. Ah, magic. Aha. This is what we want to do with our third character, right? Mm. Watch out for nature's wrath. That doesn't sound good. Cool. Well, I guess we're going to shimmy our character over there in a moment. And now we need to equip equip Yol with these. Okay, very good. Off you go. Go fight things then in the dark ruins. Oh yeah, we need to cast one more of these as well. Who's going to get it? You look like you might have something to do with fire. Let's find out. Nope, you don't. Get wrecked. Get absolutely wrecked. get wrecked again. <laughs> Did we just get the stone of regret or something? Did it say? The new building takes intelligence for building efficiency. Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Got you. The efficiency. Yeah, the statistic, right? So we might want to upgrade our character with some more intelligence. I believe is what you're saying. We could do that. we got coin to spend. So Rosaline, we would select for intelligence training. AKA education. And maybe just a general level up would help as well. Okay, you're level four now. Let's get you over there. You're going to be crafting stuff. Uh, what does that require as well? Funnery fabric, eh? So we need some planks. Or over here, just cloths. Four to eight in total. Here we go. Uh, then I can select the next ones, can't I? So you can have all of the magician gear. Okay, um, go wreck house in the dark ruins again, I guess. And we'll go back and we'll finish this. What do I get? Ghost tears! Sweet! I love the tears of a ghost. My favourite drink. Leela says, I'd love to see you play through Doom again, Asuma. Maybe on the next hardest level or something, so it's not a repeat what you did last time. I spent a bit of time back in the day trying to find more Doom stuff to play, but I couldn't find anything quite in my, like, ability range, so to speak. Like, I did play um, Evolution and the TNT ones, but they were just a bit too difficult for me to get anywhere. Like, I got past the first couple of levels, and that was on easy. <laughs> so, uh, yeah. 
But hey, the new Doom game will be coming out soon. Cool, I just did another thing, apparently. How are we doing over here as well? Let's let's get the team relaxing, maxing, ain't too taxing. Okay, so what's this one? Buy a buff for a character. Where do we buy a buff? In the church. Oh, okay, so the spa as well. Buffs, heavy hand. Now, is that permanent? Probably just for the next round, right? Tactics. I just got a tactics achievement. I'm starting to see what Zul'jin was saying about it being deceptively deep. I think it's... I wouldn't say it's deep. It's more complex. I mean, to split hairs, you could say either, really. It wants us to upgrade the fashion house. My favourite place. Oh, and it costs iron and money. That's so expensive. Well, that's where we're at now, I guess. Let's go in there and do that again. So do you even need my help at this point? Because you're going to wreck house now. Oh, good God, one hit kill. We've created a monster, people. We've created a literal monster. Right, coming back over here, let's get you Adept's shirt. Each member ad inflicts an additional 12 dark damage. That's awesome. Level 5. Ah, oh. level five on everything. Basically, you've got to go over here, click that, click this, go back, and then you're good enough, right? Now you're good enough. There's your fancy shirt. Adept's pants. Intelligence goes up. Yep, we want that. Adept's hood. Nature damage. Oh, and we'll just we'll just stick to what their character usually has, right? You can also now use that sword, although we're saving that for our other character, I guess. Right then, um, just to confirm, none of these are particularly better, are they? No, not really. Okay, so we should be able to sell and get some money back. We've got quite a bit of money now, haven't we? Dollar dollar bill, y'all. That's what they say, isn't it? Let's send you back in. Keep doing the runs. Not those runs, jeez. Dirty mind. <coughs> Toilet humour, goodness me. Uh, Karuku fans to say, assume are you still friends with Iskow85? Of course I am. What would make you ask that? Jeez. You're all about the fashion, says Jess. Yeah, me and my fashion in this game. My favourite element. My favourite aspect. Sure, sure. Okay, so, could I keep using up this cotton just to sell stuff for a while? Maybe we should pay attention to what materials tend to stack up, if you like, first. Also, I wonder how we get to have three people in our party. Can we upgrade this thing here? Maybe we'll see an upgrade option when the fight is over. I think I might try Rosaline on... Do you think Rosaline's ready? Probably not, actually. I really don't think he'll be ready yet. Yeah, there might be an upgrade tab here eventually, but it doesn't seem to be one right now. Right, uh, let's send you to the other area this time. And then while you're out there, we'll figure out what other stuff... Look at this. Nine of those. Eight of them. Goodness me, we've got all the crafting in the world to do now. All of it, literally. Um... Let's hold on to that then. We'll make our pine planks. We'll make our wolf leather and our chestnut stuff as well. There's a competition available. I don't even know. I really want that one. We need a particular drop for it, which we ain't got yet. Uh, there's another upgrade here. Ooh, maple plank. That'll be from the next area. So the fashion house, eh, we're sort of trudging along in that direction a bit, I guess. How's the fight going? Ah, yes, we've got to keep making our uh, our potions, don't we? Craft the Miaximum, please. Oh, we didn't make a healing 
medallion for our new character. Also, this is new. Helps to solve mysteries. That, I'm not sure if that actually... That's probably for this character. Let's get you a healing medallion, maybe? Yeah, it's going to be a while before you'll be level 9. Right, let's get him on the job. Okay, you can go back up there. Okay, do you think Rosaline is ready yet, peeps? I like this Minecraft texture pack. Where did you get it from, Ziskoki? I've never heard that joke before. I've never heard that joke before. Well, there's certainly crafting stuff. Oh, I can see all my items here. So Rat Tail is the one that we've got loads of. And then we need... Infected Flesh. Now we have three of it. Nice. Okay, where did we make... We made it over here, I believe. That sounded like a witch's laugh a second ago. There it is. We need two of those, I believe. We're making them. Let's chuck you down here. Now, what was it we combined it that with? Combined it? New word. Yes, that's right. This thing here. So, when we have two of those, we can make that. Stinging skin, which can be used to make a hunter's helmet or a hunter's plate. What about that thing? It wants four for that one. That's the one that I really want. I think I might hang in here a little bit then. Right, let's send them off again. At this point, it feels like it's going to be more beneficial to get Rosaline able to fight down here. So maybe we should just level her up again. And then send you out on a run and see if you do okay. On your own. Oh, fighting an elite monster straight away. That's just cruel, that is. That's just cruel. Okay, chuck that potion. Still got a wimpy weapon. Why didn't I give her a better weapon? I think I might have been a bit of a fool here. Let's actually just retreat for now. Have a better weapon. Damage depends on stats. Got ya. So how? what do I need to make you a staff? Oh, I can make a staff. Oh, we should totally do that. Right, let's, well, let's get rid of that silly weapon then. Uh, we've got a noise in the ear as I juggle too many tasks here. Okay, you're all good, you're all good. So let's go into that area. It's Lizzie Bess with the cheers and the bits saying, Show love, Asuma. You were so nice to ask. I was part of the choir that performed the Verdi's Requiem Mass. It was fantastic. Oh, you were in the show. That is superb. Um,. I now need to know... I'm going to copy that and put it on my little after-stream things to do. Verdi's Requiem Mass. Please let me copy that, Streamlabs. I will check that out. There we go. After the stream. Thank you for letting me know, Lizzie. I appreciate that. We also had Epic K9. 10, as I like to say. Resubscribe for 29 months. Saying, are you a gamer? If so, please rise up. I've told you before, I'm not a gamer, okay? I just play video games. It's just the thing that I do. It's my job. <laughs> Oh, thank you to the both of you for the support. Appreciate it ever so much. Will you ever do a face reveal, says my boy? Yeah, I mean, you're talking like I've never done a face reveal. I've done a face reveal on my second channel. It's one of the most viewed videos on there. People always talk about it, that video. Hey, look, I get a sword. And it's a bandit's crossbow. That might be really good for us. Okay, you've made a staff. Also, please go in here and make more of those. Thank you. Thank you very much for making them. Let's check it out. So, is that better? Yep, it is all around. Except agility comes down, which is kind of annoying. Uh, I think I'm just going to sell these other ones. I don't want to juggle items all the time. It's so annoying doing that. Okay, so the Adept's Staff requires level 5. That's cool. So, let's go give you the Adept's Staff. There it is. Nice. Now, how much damage does it? What does it do? Does it mean you can shoot fireballs? <laughs> What's sick hamsters? 
All oh, right, bring free potion and minor healing. Let's just do that. Go on then. What is that even anyway? The character does ten more damage to elite monsters. Ah, that's one of those things that we're never too sure if we want or not. And it went to Rosaline. Hmm. I don't know how we had control who got that, but that's not probably something we want on her. Ugh. You live and you learn. Well, not we already learned that, but I didn't. <coughs> Didn't really learn much, did I? Okay, go on then. Special weapon. An engineer's musket? Whoa! Keep out of the reach of children. Good idea. Good idea. We just did a whole bunch of things then. So who gets that weapon? 58 damage. Defense will come down, but we'll have vampirism. Oh, that's good. Intelligence will go up. And nature damage resistance. So again, the agility statistic is going to pinch us a bit. But that will give vampirism, which is cool. Okay, let's come down here and sell off our simple crossbow and militia sword. And bandit's crossbow as well, I believe. The first one. But the second one we're holding on to for that agility stat. Okay, um, now we've got a lot of coin to spend. We need to keep grinding. We've also got something here. Oh, we really need pine logs, so I'm not going to do that. And apparently that was a great decision. Well, there we go. There we go. Right, now let's go check out this thing. So we need lots of pine planks. So if we come over here... Where is it? Pine plank? Hey, oof. Right, get down there and do your thing, you know. Okay, we got anything new to make? Hammer of Light. Wow, that sounds cool. Sad Plank. So we know how to make the desecrated ingots. What about the sad plank? We've got a noise in the ear. So two sorrow stones and two of those other things. Oh, this is, this is getting interesting now. Because we're making all the things, right? Okay. So we need you to make a sad plank. We have to wait a second. Right, I've got a noise in me and I will read it in a second. I am just juggling. I'm juggling the things, right? So we need to make two sad planks and I think two things up here, right? Two desecrated ingots. Those ingots are getting desecrated, my friends. And then we shall make this. No. Who makes it? It's the other one. So, again, to get the better... Oh, yeah, we sold your weapon, so we don't have to swap it around. Right. <laughs> I'm probably speaking so fast, you're like, what is he talking about? Oh, you needed four sad planks. Oh, why are you doing this to me? Which one was the sad plank again? It was the purple ball. Okay, two of those. Bear with me, peeps. Then we'll be making two of these. We've got a noise in here here from I Love Cats. Saying, so apparently, I decided to hurt myself. I started learning some... Scott Joplin on the piano and some Stevie Wonder on guitar. All in all, my hands hurt. That, well, that is good, cats. If your hands hurt, you've been playing and, and flexing those muscles. Flexing those muscles, cats. Cats has been flexing. I, I love flexing. That's the real name right there, jeez. Cats, thank you so much as always for the nation sport. Hope you're uh, enjoying hanging out with us today. As we just chill out, you know? Just chill out. Thief. Permanently saps one to six attributes from the target. Huh. That sounds awesome. And a random effect as well. Pretty cool. Lizzie Bess says he's not serious about his video games as a gamer is. He's casual about it. Yeah, I wouldn't even call myself a casual gamer though. Really, like, if it weren't for this, I don't think I'd be playing a lot of games. You know? Uh, we got the jamming here, resubscribing for 36 months. That's an emerald face in the chat saying, wow, that's a lot of time. Keep up the good work and I'll keep supporting you. Cheers, mate. Thank you so much, man. I appreciate it. Thank you for sticking around for three years. That's, that's crazy right there, isn't it? Craziness. Leah Leah says, Stevie Wonder. Yeah, Leah, you gave me that Stevie Wonder record to listen to, I'm pretty sure. I, uh, I listen to it like on shuffle every now and then. I always enjoy it when he comes on. I, I, think, it got, I think it got lost in like a... A playlist from two years ago. Every year I reset my playlist and some records just end up in the playlist graveyard. <laughs> but uh, I really like Stevie Wonder's music. At some point, at some point I'll get to that bit where it will like really click and I'll be like, okay, now I, now I have to listen to this record. But uh, until that happens... Ooh, wait a minute. So you can't use... Whoa! 
You can't use this. Right, agility 36 and intelligence 40. Agility 36, intelligence 40. Agility is... So maybe it was just intelligence that was low? Right, that's quite a few levels to go there. I'm also looking at the wrong character. Let's try that again. Agility 36. I mean, maybe... So intelligence is good. Maybe if I level you up, what will you get there? Just one point? Oh, it doesn't seem so good, does it? I'm going to train you up anyway. It's about time we did that. Wait, did I just level up the wrong character? Nope, no, I didn't. So we need 36 on that. If I do it once, it's not going to give me a plus two, is it? Hmm. It's not worth it, basically. Well, we'll have to wait to use that one, then. Right, let's get them out there grinding levels again. They've had their stats up, which is good. Let's make sure everyone's got potions. And Rosaline should be good to go and try a grind on her own. What you like with that staff there? Oh! Wrecking house! Wrecking the house, come on. Oh. Yeah, she needs a like a stat boost and... Oh, hang on, we're coming up against an elite here. Yeah, you'll be alright. All that elemental damage going on there. Cat says, Stevie Wonder is one of the best musicians I know. You know Stevie Wonder? Nah, I'm messing with you. I know what you mean. <laughs> uh. Oh, we are doing the business here. So, can I just go replay like that? Just, just straight away, get back in there, keep doing your thing. I mean, the time to heal saves us potions, but we're here to grind out some results, you know. Do you know what I am saying? Do you know what I'm saying? TD Cavalry says, I think he's just pragmatic. What does it matter what he looks like? We enjoy watching him play and talking about games. What he looks like is irrelevant. TD Cavalry, I couldn't agree with you more. Okay. My hideous deformation is irrelevant, people. Why do I have to keep telling you that? <laughs> oh. Right, I could send her back in again, but for her, I'm going to let her have a break. Oh, goodness me, who are you? You look scary. Right, let's bring you back over here. How many potions did we get to make? A few. Oh, give essence, sure. Okay, ancient plates are after that. The search must go on. Okay, we'll do that again. A bit of so... Okay, I thought that one was done. Um, let's make sure we got the spa going on, relaxing, taxing, ain't too maxing thing. And I think we need to level you up one more. And then the grind will be a bit easier for you. Let's get a replay on that. Let's get the potions rolling in. Oh, only one for that run. Okay, so Noel's got that leeching weapon, so whenever Noel takes damage, we should see some healing going on. That would probably be better for our tank at the front, really. We might not even see anything happen here. Cat says, don't you worry about being... about a thing is such an amazing piece, such a creative cool progression. Alright, oh, we're referring to a song there, right? Jess says, I'm picking up what you're putting down. Cat <laughs> says, good old Stevie is a good friend. The Black Ranger PL says, was just digging under the ocean in Minecraft. I swim up to the surface to find how far the next shore is and a fox randomly spinning in the water next to me. Lol. That is a bit odd. Why would it be out there in the water? You know, what is it playing at? What kind of strategy is that for a fox? That's our last potion up the top here. Although we'll get stocked up when we replay. Oakley dokely then. Let's do another one. Are we progressing towards fighting the boss? Once we killed it once, do we get to fight it again? Is that a thing? I have 
no idea. I have so many questions. Uh, I think we'll wait to do a bunch of stuff when they're out of their runs, actually. Ah, look, right, let's see this weapon at the back in action. So, 60 hit points. Yeah, 19, and then doubled. Excellent. And we got an elite over here. How are you going to do? I'm going to help you. See ya. Get wrecked. Victory is ours, peeps. Do you have a healing potion? You should have a healing potion. That's slightly concerning. Especially when you have all these things that we need. There we go. That's what I wanted to see. Okay, they'll be good. They'll be good. They'll be fine. They'll be dandy. Let's craft the Miaximum. Okay. Uh, get in the spa. I think regular spa trips are less expensive than um, leaving it too long. Because it's quite pricey if you leave it too long. Elegant breastplate. Awesome. Let's go check it out. Who gets to wear it? I think that's Hoshi's. So, required level 10. Damage would go down, defense would go up. We'd get stamina points from that, though. It's not actually that good. I think I might just sell it. Woohoo! It's worth a lot. Did I miss a stat here? Did I miss a stat, peeps? You know? The Black Ranger says, I mean, there's a tiger biome somewhere nearby, but still a good 100 blocks away. Maybe he was hunting for fish. Maybe he was running away from you, even though you were in the caves. It was some sort of like AI glitch, and uh, and that caused it to swim out. Possibly something like that is what I would guess. I think I'm going to level up No. There we go. You've been leveled up, mate. Right. No new things over here, but let's get our pine planks crafted up. And our chestnut planks. I think those are just the two we need. Over here, we're going to have iron ingots. I think I'll save a few in case we need more desecrated ingots. And we can make loads of copper ingots. A forged spear, hey? Hmm. Okay, so we need to do this, and we can do it now. Excellent. Nice. Question is, should we now go inside the uh, comp... What's this? You can buy the recipes. Ah. Ah, okay. Ah, there are some choices to be made here, then. Look at all these different... Flying bee. That's so cool. Oh my goodness me. I was starting to see what um, Zuljin was saying about it being deep. There's there's a lot going on here. Right. Let's collect our coin. Let's also go enter that competition. Okay. Who's going to go in? Can we send in three of them yet? Yeah, we can. In you go. Let the competition begin. New accessory. Buy Frost Axe Blueprint in the Fashion House 2. Frost Axe, hey? The axe of the old Frosty. We need cotton fabric. We need three of them. <laughs> That's Total Witch Cackle, that is. Total Witch Cackle. Right, how's the, uh, how's the old thing going? Did we start it? Ah, there it is. That's probably getting close to the end. Brandy Nicole, welcome to the stream, buddy. Black Ranger says, ah, there's a wolf on the shore. Mystery solved. Oh, there you go. Right, how did we do? How did we do? I mean, we've got better chances than before because we've got three peeps in. Yay, stuff. Okay, uh, we need you to make those. And then we're able to buy this frost axe. The old axe of the frost. Look, those things are like overlapped up there, aren't they? We found a bug! 
This game isn't flawless. I want my money back. Unbelievable. Okay, let's buy that. Okay, that gives me a thing, right? New accessory. Cool. I got some iron ore. Cool. Right, is that still going to be broken? No, it's not. Elite bones the next. Kill five elite ghouls. Goodness me. We're up against the elites now. Um, what should we do with this stockpile of materials? Do I want to craft something? How much of that we got? No, I think I'll hold on to it. And over here... See, now we've got quite a bit of that. So we could... Ectoplasm. I don't think that's something you craft, so we'll ignore that. i tell you what I could do, though. I could look in here for something like... Ooh. Look at these things, eh? So I can afford the elegant helmet. Group armor. That sounds awesome. Crafted in smithy. Do we have a smithy? That's what it's called, right? Okay, so let's say we buy that. Okay, now we can make the elegant helmet over here. Interesting. Two elegant plates. And we can't afford it. Oh, it's just typical. Let's go find the ectoplasm. It's in this area. Who did I click on, by the way? Okay, good, good, good. Sweet! We just got some ectoplasm peeps. Ectoplasm hype! I did not know that we would be having ectoplasm hype on one of my streams, but it's a thing. Don't forget about the library, says Beard4. Oh yeah, I have forgotten about that. Let's see what's going on over here. So we can... Didn't we already buy that? Yeah, we bought these. Healing looks like something I want to buy. It just costs time and money, so we'll do... Oh, that spent all of my coin. That spent all of my coin, didn't it? I'd like to be less reliant on those uh, healing potions. That's essentially it. We're going to get a whole bunch more this time. My goodness me, we're wrecking house up here. Alrighty then. Um, let's do the spa. Yeah. It got pricey again. It might be that the price goes down as their health goes up as well. Yeah, actually, that looks to be true. Okay, health goes up a bit. Hmm, we'll, we'll check back on that in a second. Uh, go on, then. Oh, okay. <laughs> that seems to be it. <clears throat> oh, still 53. Okay. So, we got that ectoplasm. That was my favourite bit of the stream, getting that ectoplasm, you know. So we can make two of these. Then, we can come over here. Wrong one. There you go. While you're over here, we'll have maximum of those. And do the old drag and drop game. Just in time for Hoshi. Okay, let's check out our new equipment, right? Oh, I'm not good enough to wear it. Required level 10. Hmm, we already got a really cool alternative one there with strength on it. I'm <laughs> not sure if it's even that great. This reminds me of Diablo juggling all these different things, right? And sometimes it just makes sense to wait until you get something that's really blatantly better than what you've already got. I'm going to sell that. I think I might sell that breastplate as well. Or we'll be waiting on a level for that. I think it was. It just didn't have... Do you know what? Since our, our current one doesn't add to the other stat, it kind of makes sense to use that, but we would lose a fair bit of damage. I think I might just sell it. Let's just sell it. Can't be bothered to figure out the numbers. Right, let's perhaps level up. Where, where, where do we want this money to go? First of all, we've got a heal down here. Or relax, even. 
Okay, maybe do individual stats here, so let's get your intelligence up. We'll give them all a bit of a stat boost. Strength for you. And for Noel, it'll be agility. Something like that, then we can spend some money down here. Shield breaker, defenselessness. I like the sound of shield breaker more. Okay, that's being researched. Right, let's do the grind again. Send them on their way. That plate is so elegant, says Cats. It is indeed. 740 says, hey X, when are we getting a face reveal? It's on the second channel, man. Is there a bonus for having a complete set to grind? I don't know. That's a good... I haven't seen anything that would indicate it's set bonuses. We've got an elite up here. Don't be harming us too much now. Hey, double attack. That was good. Right, so we need to kill five elite ghouls. Where are the ghouls to be found? Okay, two victories. A quick trip to the spa. Um, which ones? Ah, there we go. Click on it to find out. Skeleton and skeleton. Possessed. So it's probably in this area, right? Which one is the ghoul? Ghost warrior? Ghoul. Okay, so we need to grind that area out now. That is an elite ghoul. They're probably putting them in our path now. One hit point. Crazy. Yeah, I'm going to guess they put them in our path because we need to kill a few of them. Um, I guess you might as well continue with your fight. Uh, Grout to Mech says, believe me, you don't want a face, a face reveal from a sumo. I heard he's got a nose right in the middle of his face. Nobody wants to see that. <laughs> Talbar says, what are we up to this evening? Just, uh, grinding out on this game. It's, uh, this game has certainly revealed its gameplay loop. Doesn't feel like, you know, you're just going to continue going deeper into this web of stats and weapons and yeah it's a bit of fun but I don't think this game's worth playing all the way to the end for me that's just my preference though right um pretty good do we want to replay yeah I guess we just keep replaying what I should do though is make sure we're uh, always topped up over here what we got going on in the village? Yeah, go on then. Okay, soldier's breastplate. It's not even worth what I gave you for it. Rubbish. Feel like I've just been robbed. Robbed by my own generosity, eh? Right, well, they'll keep doing their thing. We'll send you out again. Um, we should make, organize a trip to the spa. We can do that mid-fight, apparently. And that was very pricey and silly of me. I'll tell you what I haven't been making. The mana pots, right? We want five more of those. It helps us solve mysteries. Hmm. Needs four of those things. Could certainly work towards that. Shield Breaker 1. We now have that. That's cool. Let's send them out again. It's a clicker game, says I Cats. 
Yeah, it, it basically is sort of. I mean, the thing with clicking games is that. Well, the clicking often feels a lot more direct, right? But yeah, you're right, this is pretty much a clicking game. Okay, let's send you over there to do a job. Tauber says, I saw a video on YouTube about an idle click of games a while ago. It was a great video, and it was the first video the lad made. Alright. <laughs> so how many of those things have we killed now? Three out of five. Here's where I want to heal. A healing spell, right? Ah, here's a thing. You're making those in four seconds. Three, two, one. Can I? Th then I can use it mid-game, by the looks of it. So that's interesting, isn't it? get you the replay. So I could do that. Ah, I only gave 40. Wow, that's. Uh, I think I just kept them alive. Well, that's alright then, isn't it? Hey, look, there's another elite. So that's the five elites done, right? I can drink some water for my tickly throat. <coughs> oh, excuse me. Whew! Lady Gwyn says, I just got on here. What is this game? Haven't heard it before. We, we, we're, we're basically admitting it's a clicker game at this point, I think. It's the consensus. I mean, it's fun. You make some decisions, but the gameplay loop really kind of confines your decisions to its linear progression. And it's very slow paced. So uh, it's been fun, like, learning it. Oh, we've still got another elite ghoul to kill, have we? But, uh, yeah, I mean, the fun's kind of been had now. Do you know what I might do? I might start... Hmm. What about more upgrades, right? Like, what else needs... Pine. Yeah, look, ten pine planks. Maybe we should do that. Start stockpiling them, at least. Yeah, there's probably a few more buildings that could benefit from something here. Uh, do we want to do this? Group healing? Yeah, that sounds like a really good one, especially if we get to a boss fight. So what else needs pine? You don't need pine. Oh, there we go. Maple log. Okay. That then allows us to make the maple logs, doesn't it? Pine planks, four. Excellent. So what happens now that's upgraded? Ah! But we don't have access to this. This is probably in the next range of things to do, right? Um, so we can possibly make funnery fabric, which gives us access to... This looks kind of doable, right? No. Sorry, I'm reading that wrong. Funerary. These are not funerary. But those are, is the point. What is that? That's a crazy amount of critical damage. I don't know if that's better than what we currently got or if it's worth doing. Swamp Staff. Let's have a look. Level 9. Hmm. Doesn't give us more intelligence. <laughs> that it does not. Hey, did we kill five of the things yet? No. Let's go fight. And then back over here, you can do that grind. Daylight robbery. Rehab. They're in a dreadful mood. Great. Does that mean I've got to send them to the spa? Yeah. Wait, that probably cost more because I was in the middle of a fight, but whatever. F funerary is in funeral. Oh, okay. Funeral robes. Great. How grim. It feels like a flash game. Someone has worked into a proper game, but the end's not real deep or interesting. Yeah, that's how I'm feeling now. I mean, it was fun learning it, but yeah, like I said, it reveals its loop pretty quick, and then it's like, eh, just doing the same old thing over and over again, aren't I? Monsters weak. Right. 
Elite, five Elite Possessed now. Where are those Elite Possessed, eh? I wonder if I can use something of help here. Keeping you alive, that's what I'm doing. Okay, so... Was it the other one then, probably? Yeah, Elite Possessed, and we haven't seen any yet, so in you go. Show us what you got. And let's make sure... Uh-oh, SpaghettiOs. Let's come down here and uh, make our mana pots. Pots, bleh. Okay, you're not in the fight, so you can do that. Right, and we might need to use a healing potion here. In fact, we will. Because you ain't going to be able to heal again. Wow. What you got? Death. It's this guy at the back, man, who's doing all the damage. I see how it's happening. Nice. If you select heal or spa while they're in the fight, it just queues it up for right after they finish it, says Ferber Street. Oh, okay. Well, I guess we've got to replay that grind. So when it comes to stats, we could do with our fella at the back doing more damage, really. We could increase the strength a couple of rounds, just because that first hit seems to do so much. And then who can get leveled up? I think I'll hold on to our coin for now. Why are those faces there? Always confuses me. Because the other ones are in. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, 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 we've learned all this. Right, have we seen any elites yet? I don't think we have. It kind of looks like uh, a regular dude. <laughs> yeah, look. And there you're free to go. Cool, lots and lots of items. What are they good for though, right? Got to craft stuff with them, basically. Maybe it makes sense to buy something over here now. Ooh, titanium, eh? Like, what kind of weapon? Pulsating sphere, what is that even? Is that is that a hypnotic cube? Is there like another bit of equipment? I don't know where that would go. Anyway, I guess they need to keep doing that. So we shall relax. And continue the fight. After this, I reckon it's going to push us on to doing a boss fight. Is what I believe. I guess you might as well do that grind. See, now we've got crazy amounts of these iron ingots. Uh... That's new, isn't it? Regeneration! Oh, That's probably good. So, more desecrated ingots. Why do we have leftover desecrated ingots, though? And exoplasm. I'm going to make that, then. So we need three desecrated ingots, which means we need an elegant plate. Surprise T says, if you're looking for another game to stream, I can suggest one. It name is something to do with factories, but I can't remember its name. Well, if you remember it, be sure to uh, let me know. I mean, Factorio and Satisfactory have been like the hype lately, so the whole factory thing is kind of picking up a bit. Who knows where it'll go. Let's, uh, let's drop you here and drop you there. Okay, now you can now make that desecrated ingot, and then we can make those woodcutter's boots. I'm starting to think we should just batch craft a bunch of uh, bunch of things here and send it on its way. Wait a minute, didn't we just make an extra one of those? Yeah, because look at this, 19. I'll hold a little bit in reserve. So make 16 of that, and then I can make 10 of these or something. 
There you go. We'll see how that works out in terms of making us coins. So, do we need dark levers for these? Yep, we'll do the same thing over here then. So, although that being said, Scarecrow's helmet. We need Rotten Slice, which we can now make two of. Excellent. Yo, sup, Suma, my dude. Is this game any good? Says Hyper Stampy. If you're really into clicker games, this is a clicker game. Oh, you need that dark lever. I have not made the dark lever. I basically can batch craft that. I, for some reason, thought it was different. Um, hmm. Now we're just sitting around watching stuff craft. Great. Infinite Factory also comes to mind. Says Tornaquade. Yeah. Tornaquade? Torrid and Nake. Who knows? I'm butchering everything, right? <clears throat> okay, so once the dark levers are made, we should be able to make. I'm not even trying to make this. So I need four of those. Okay, so if we go into equipment and we check out these other things that we got, are any of them better? That one is. That's way better. Sweet. Let's equip it. Okay, so we can get rid of those other ones, right? Although I can't help but feel, isn't that the amazing one that we just put on? Wait, what just, what did we just do? I didn't put it on. Ah, I need level 9. Well, we know what we're going to do now. Okay, you're going to become level 9. Go down here, sell off the last ones. Okay, we've got those woodcutter's boots, and we're going to make... Ah, that's what I was going to make. The Scarecrow's shirt. So, wait, what does that mean I need to make? Yeah, this whole crafting thing isn't so great either. It's like a constant, oh, I've got to go over here, oh, I've got to go over there. I'm trying to juggle or remember little things. Not my strength. Not to my strength at all, right. Oh, look, we've got a new thing here. Whispering Shadows, eh? Well, I can make that as it goes. Okay, so now we're going to make that thing. Let's go check it out. 20 intelligence. Wow, that sounds like something for... Rosaline, right? Current stuff is 13 intelligence. It's better all around. But you won't let me wear it because it required level 8. Hey, just enough to get you there. Okay, so we do that. Uh, what just happened? Okay, those items managed to stack. That was kind of weird. So this thing would give us agility and fire damage. So defense goes down, damage goes up a little bit. It's pretty pants. But it'll sell. Whispering Shadows, we'll sell that. So then we got that thing there as well, we can sell that. So this Scarecrow thing... What do we realise with this? 24% at the beginning of the character's move to heal the whole party by 14 points. It removes agility. It's worth a heck of a lot though. I don't want to lose those agility points. I don't think that's worth it, and it's... You get a lot of money for it, so uh, don't mind if I do. So that's that's okay. That's where we start to make some money to level up our characters quickly. By trying to make complex stuff like this. We've just discovered that's worth a lot, right? So we need Stinging Skin, which means we need Rotten Slice. Which I actually... Didn't I make the Rotten Slice for this thing? Anyway, it doesn't matter, because that thing sucked. So if I make a couple more of those... I don't think that's going to affect how many more of this we can make four apparently at the moment. Then we need a bunch of those. So I think eight would be... Craft them. 
Also, let's give them all a relax. And it might be a good idea to level up Null now because the stat boost we'll get. That we're going to do you twice. Okay, so we'll go back down because he's going to make us money with uh, these stats. In fact, that is agility, right? So if we go check out. So if I do a little bit more of this specific. Okay, it might seem a bit of a mad strategy there. Something popped up and then disappeared. Probably because I spent all my money. Uh, now, when we... Yeah, we can craft two. Okay, but our agility is better. 27% chance now. Hmm. I think it's actually like a roll of the dice as opposed to each little stat increases in general the item that you create. That's purple for some reason. Okay, so let's go check this out. 4,000! We found the money maker, peeps! 29% chance of the beginning of a character's move to heal, 38 points. Now that is a bit more tempting, isn't it? It, is, it adds health, it takes away agility though. And then we've got another one that's crazy good. So that one's way better. But this one gives you intelligence and physical damage resistance. See, I think it's worth putting that on. But we don't have a party of three yet. So I'm going to sell the lesser one. Scarecrow's shirt. Which one's the not as good one? Yeah, I think it's that one's way better, basically. So we'll hold on to the other one. But there we go. We've got 4,000 coin. And uh, Torinaquaid says, I do dislike this kind of micromanagement crafting. Me too. In fact, the micromanagement in general can be a bit irritating when you realise that you're just going to continuously do this to, like, grind and step up, you know? But hey, we're, we're like a tiny bit better now, as, as evidence of. It'd be nice if you could make these runs quicker. If these runs could be done faster, then they'd be pretty... be a bit more engrossing. Level 1? Level 1?! No, I know what's going on there. Let's get you up as well, actually. Hey, we've got another elite. There you go. Between the two of them, they take care of it. Um, what should we do now? Have we got all these things crafted up? Nope. I guess uh, another option would be to buy something from here, right? Something that looks really cool. Finger of Retribution. I mean, what would give us an idea as to how much they would sell for as well? Masculinity! <laughs> oh. You could also maybe just buy up stuff that requires things that you're building in excess of, like if you've got lots of materials. But, uh, man, I can't be getting into this level of craziness. Right, we've got a victory, obviously. Let's go fight again, because we need to kill one more. And you, I guess, can come over here and keep doing your grind. Just check the equipment for healing potions. Cool. Are there mods for this game, says Marion? I don't think so. Torrid Nake says... That's half the reason I dislike modded Minecraft. So many sub combines. Yeah, yeah. It gets so grindy, right? It just needs to be kept simple. Like the fun isn't is rarely in the recipe making. It modded. By the way, peeps, we've got 270 people watching. Be sure to hit the follow button. Make sure you uh, catch the next live streams, which might not be for a couple of days as of right now. Yeah. I'm doing that thing. I'm telling you to hit the follow button. You know how it goes. It's Twitch. Come on. Leave me alone. Jeez. Right, what's the next thing I've got to do then, eh? War never changed. Kill the big boy. Is that a boss? That's probably the boss, right? How close are we even to it? Ugh. Such a grind. So is that the big boy? Oh, that one is. Okay. And then this one is Skull of Knowledge. So we need to do this one. Is what you're telling me. Right, I think we'll spend our coin on levelling up our characters. 
Oh, oh. Well, can't do it twice. Fair enough. Um, peeps. We're coming up on four hours into this game now, and I think we've seen. I think I think we've seen the gameplay loop. I, I do not want to um, grind this one out. I, it was fun to check it out. I hope you enjoyed hanging out with me. It was a, a good one, but uh, we probably won't be playing this game again. Basically, <laughs> um, it's cool. It was interesting, but it's a heart a clicker game, and there's not a lot of creativity going on here. So I'm not ripping on the game. Just kind of. Identifying, what's that? New weapon blueprint. Oh, let's find out what it is. No. Um, yeah, this just ain't my uh, quite my cup of tea. I mean, I do like the clicking games, but I think the gameplay loop needs to have some sort of element of challenge or creativity. This is very grind, so uh, yeah. That'll be it from this game, from me, from this game. And I'll be sure to pick up probably another new game sometime soon. But expect to see some Hermitcraft 1.14 coming your way and all of that. Um, anyway. If you wanted to catch the Hermitcraft stream from earlier today, that'll be uploaded on the second channel right after this stream finishes. Big thanks to everyone for tuning in today. Thanks to all the people who subscribed, resubscribed, donated, and cheered. As always, I appreciate your support. Thank you to all of my Patreons. And if you want to stick around, we'll be doing a raid. Let's go find out who we are going to riggedy raid. Um, I believe it should be Missful Symmetry on the Hermitcraft server. Doing a charity stream as well. So I'm going to send you over to full. So when you stick around, be a part of the raid. So don't go anywhere just yet. Okay, I'm typing it out now. Okay, we're raiding full speech. So you all got to come over with me. Be sure to click on the thing in the chat and join the raid, yeah? Because um, Force is doing a big stream, so it'll help her out. Anyway, that's it for me. Thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you later. Bye-bye.